minute gone by, choppy start. Morris zigs and zags his way around. Bogdanovich gets into the heart of the lane and knocks it down. No look inside to Marvin Bagley. A nice little pass there by Ivy, and Bagley will go to the line for a couple. Well, that was something that the Clippers have missed when both Morris and Leonard were out of a the lineup. They said they got a little bit of it from Avita Zubac, but that post-up threat is real for both of them. Hayes for three. Morris. Contested mid-range comes up short. And Bay with a rebound for the piston. Bogdanovich is six foot seven, so he's a little bigger than you might think he is. Morris. Help defense from behind by Ivy. Maybe they're going to call a jump ball. And right now, probably to Paul George's left hand in that cup area. The toss to Tep, one by the Pistons. This is five shots right now for the Clippers from distance. The team that was electric from downtown a year ago. Is George with a contested long two. Non-unsportsmanlike. So it's a sportsmanlike. So there are two negative like equal technical positive. Fouls, yeah. <laughs> Back iron. All for 10 from deep for the Pistons. Who lead it by one. One thing I've noticed about Isaiah Lewis, he is truly a a a, a They had been a starter for much of his time with the Pistons. Tough shot for Morris. Rebound inside goes to Zoo over the extra fingertips of Duran. Misfires. Clippers just 11 for 33 from the field. They had a little bit of momentum before the timeout. Bay 4-3. It is short. Pistons are 0 for 11. Clippers just 2 for 8. Morris. Rhythmic 3. Ivy dashing down the lane. Finds Knox in the corner for three. Holds the finish, not there. Just two for 17 now on the season. Six to shoot for Morris. Tough possession. Good defense by Knox. And that's going to do it. A disappointing first half for the Clippers. Six to shoot for Morris. Tough possession. Good defense by Knox. And that's going to do it. A disappointing first half for the Clippers. Six to shoot for Morris. Tough possession. Good defense by Knox. And that's going to do it. A disappointing first half for the Clippers. Zoo clearing everybody out. They miss him inside. So a contested three by Morris falls. You'll take the bucket, but Zoo is working awful hard inside. To force the big man to step up, and that leaves his guy wide open. Morris all alone on the wing for three. Can he do it again? Yes, sir. Second straight three from Morris. And the Clippers cut the lead down to two. Bogdanovich takes inventory, requests a screen from Bagley. George knocks it out of his hands with eight to shoot. A busted possession. Bogdanovich looking for the whistle when he gets it. Morris has hit a couple of threes. Takes it to the 15-foot mark. Knocks that one down. Wherever he's shooting, he's been pretty good all year. Have that problem all the time. George down the lane. Morris waits on the flyby. Pulls the trigger. This one comes up. Ball fake on the flyby. A good recovery there by the Pistons. From one piston to another, Marcus Morris inside, off the window, and in. He's campaigning for a whistle. He gets one. It's a team. Ball fake on the flyby. A good recovery there by the Pistons. From one piston to another, Marcus Morris inside, off the window, and in. He's campaigning for a whistle. He gets one. It's a team. Tries to dodge the screen set by Durham, goes around it. Bogdanovich picked up by Zhu off the window. No, and Marcus Morris Sr. with a rebound. Leonard. Morris. Contested three. Got it! For as he hits some tough shots. His third three tonight. Powell, four to shoot. Into the paint. Tough possession. Morris beats the buzzer. And the Pistons have the ball. It goes out of bounds. Last touch by Detroit. And sometimes a player does come back in a spectacular, and then for the next three games after that, he winds up tailing off. He shifted to a different level. He's more, less concerned about his numbers.